left the brain the way they showed it. And that is, it's more complicated than just some squiggly lines with something circular. We watched something about the brain and the brain cells. I thought it was really good. I thought uh, the making of the brain was really cool. They tried to make a fully functioning human brain and put it in a, um, a fake human body to see if it actually acted like a human. Half of them want to conduct tests on the robot, and the other half thinks it's too much like a human so they can't do it. My favourite part was probably when it, when it turned into that plump brown cushion. They were squishing the brain to make it smaller. Yeah, that was fun. I really like when the scientists were all arguing about who was the best part of the brain. <coughs> Learning about how the brain cells are made and how you can make brains. Well, how you might be able to make brains. I enjoyed the part when uh, they were testing out all his senses and I like the puppeteering. I like the way that they designed him. I thought the presentation was excellent. I thought the way they told the narrative was very well. I am I'm a huge believer that science needs to be promoted as actively and as strongly as possible. I think what should happen next is that the robot should start playing tricks on all the scientists. What if the robot turned on the humans and started making its own robots? And eventually he learns how to program himself. They have an argument about deactivating and activating Pinocchio, what Pinocchio is going to do. I think the robot should actually get feelings like a real human and when the scientist thinks he's just a robot. I really love the show and I think they should really continue it. It's like sci-fi movie turns into a theatre. I really liked it. I thought the production was phenomenal, the narrative was great and actually to go as far as you can with it. Normally I just sit at a computer, but now I want to learn a bit more about brains.